Hello, Just Too Good here. And yesterday, FalconFan1414 sent me this presentation on Instagram, which had all these new 2021 Lego books. This is from the site Amit, and I believe Amit publishes a lot of these Lego activity books in general. Either way, this first book might be one of the most interesting, where we get this exclusive Cedric Diggory in a Quidditch outfit. I mean, none of the prints are exclusive, but this arrangement is exclusive. The torso is the rarest part, where it only came in the Diagon Alley set, so it's really nice to get them in a cheap set, especially for those who love Quidditch and want to army build a Hufflepuff team. It says it'll launch in the first quarter of 2021. So this one is a Ninjago Legacy activity book, and it comes with an exclusive Golden Ninja. Weirdly enough, they don't show the picture of the Golden Ninja, so part of me feels like this might be a new version of the Golden Ninja for 2021. So that's interesting. Uh, this next one, so this next one comes with a Freya McCloud minifigure and even a little build, which is cute for an activity book. This one just comes with a Batman, nothing too special, but it does have that cape from, what, last summer? And here's a layout of some of the books, but we'll get to those. Uh, this one, Spinjitzu Brothers, seems to have some history on Ninjago lore with Master Wu and Garmadon. Some samples from there. This was one that caught my eye, the Three Little Pigs story. So there's two different Three Little Pigs books coming out. And I, I love the artwork on these. Like, it just looks really fun. But they, they have the Three Little Pigs story tied in with Lego. So it's the Three Little Pigs Master Builders. That's a really cute idea. I used to love picture books when I was young, so I would have totally got this Lego ones if they actually had these. Anyways, there's a Ninjago chapter book. This one has barely any info. Uh, and this one is a very interesting little addition to here because if you see, that looks like the 2021 LEGO Ninjago sets, that whole island thing. So they even blurred out that set. That's probably just a set right there, which I understand. Well, we could get a little bit of a look. You could see like a shipwreck. You could see some of these weird plant bugs or whatever. And uh, yeah, so this is launched in the anniversary year. So this is going to launch quarter three of 2021. So summer 2021. And... Uh, this is Uncharted Island, so that seems like more of that new season. Uh, funny if they have the haunted house right there. But this is a game book. Yeah, they, you know, based off of that uh, January 2020 sets, which I did like a lot. It would have been cool if they put, like, uh, you know, Diginia in, in here. But I guess they would put that more in, like, one of those uh, DK books than an, a meat activity book. But uh, this is a Lego Jurassic World book, an early reader Ninjago book more ninjago gamer stuff this one's pretty interesting because I, I like this little attachment here and i like uh these dinos at the back which seem very lego like like a new version of them uh the bronchiosaurus right am i right in that dino fans are gonna be like that's totally wrong uh interesting hairpiece recolor in the back there with that hairpiece from the lego batman movie sets which we never got another color of uh this one okay it wasn't this one there, there is a city book i want where is the city book i want these are just really the picture books it seems like uh Right over here, new dino. Could that mean something? Could that mean something? And this one is a search and find book, which, oh, I wish they had this when I was young. I used to love search and finds. A Lego one would have just killed me. That comes out summer 2021. Uh, book of Elemental Powers. And this one I really love, which when I was young, I used to always like not only search and find Bond Christmas, the 12 Days of Christmas books. I remember I even had the CD of Shrek's 12 Days of Christmas, and we would play that over and over and over again. But uh, I love different versions of the 12 Days of Christmas theme. Like that, that's just one of my favorite things. So that's some of the books, and then the rest of the books, which uh, are more of the minifigure ones. This is the city one I want, because it comes with this guy. This guy, I don't even think he's on Bricks and Pieces. I don't think I got the pieces from Bricks and Pieces. And he comes only in like that very expensive, uh, that, that police station, I think. And that hair piece is really good to get in that color. Uh, so this one comes with a uh, Dr. Wu minifigure, which Dr. Wu is kind of common. I think this is the one from 2020 summer, right? Uh, this one comes with this guy, which... I think I have the pieces from, from Bricks and Pieces, but that's a pretty good figure to include in a cheap set. That's the official annual 2022. Uh, this is another LEGO Harry Potter activity book, but it comes with just random accessories. Nothing too special, honestly. Uh, it would be cool if they put, you know, some, some maybe exclusive print or something, but I get it. They're activity books. Uh, and then this one right here has some more accessories. Nothing too interesting either. I was hoping like a new pizza design print. Like they should make different variations of the pizza print, right? Am I the only one who thinks that? Uh, but this one has the same of Tread Octane. Um, this one caught my eye. So it's apparently next year, you can see tie-in with the 2021, oh shoot, Super Secret Dots theme. 
apparently next year dots is going to have like a code message system or something like that which sounds cool i like that like a sub theme within dots so i'm i'm, I'm kind of curious about that this one might come with some extra stuff yeah you see a unique set of bracelets and tiles including glow in the dark elements so you can only get that in this activity book but yeah i mean i i want to see more of those secret message things for dots next year this one is a Christmas book launching next summer, and uh, you have these buildable little, little, little Father Christmas elf and reindeer. And then we have uh, two more of these, these Lego Harry Potter books, which come with <laughs> Lucius Malfoy. I mean, I'll take it. This is a version from Diagon Alley. So they're putting the Diagon Alley, really expensive version, in a cheap activity book. That's cool for the people who don't have Diagon Alley who can't get it. This is a cheap alternative where Lucius Malfoy hasn't come in a set in a while aside from Diagon Alley. And this is the other book with Lucius Malfoy, which is funny because he's not even having that printed torso on the cover. But it's the same exact figure in both of these. And this is the coloring book section, so there wouldn't be any exclusive figures, but you see some fun stuff on the covers there. Any, any characters we haven't gone before, you know? And uh, over here is a Lego Jurassic World coloring book. Uh, more coloring books maybe those are just different colors covers for it ninjago covering book we have the harry potter covering book there is the city coloring book a uh, christmas coloring book it looks like a dots uh sticker book <laughs> and these are on the novelty section uh so we have treasure quest which just is like a pretty cute little idea here it's like a uh, book adventure with, with with little builds and everything. I just want to see more of like what that's about and everything. I might pick that one up. Uh, five minute builds. This is cute. Just uh, includes 50 Lego bricks and all these quick ideas for builds. Oh, come on. Uh, three exclusive models created by Lego designers. So it does come with, I think, does it come with any pieces? I don't know if that one comes with any pieces. Or maybe it does. Maybe it does. Yeah, it seems like it does. So that's pretty cute. Uh, this Jurassic World tin. So it comes with four books and a buildable figure. And it, uh, yeah, this one comes with this figure right here, which I think is the one from the gyro set, the gyro sphere set that came out recently. Am I not wrong? Am I wrong by saying that? Like that was a park worker for that set. So that means he does come in more expensive sets. So it's nice to get him in a cheap set like this. But it's nothing exclusive. Uh, this is Dots Design Fun. Just seems like another activity book. Example dots models Destiny's bounty adventure box pretty interesting Seems like it comes with these destiny bounty builds almost dimension scales, and then that's it with the displays there So that's it. I mean my favorites were the Harry Potter ones and then that city one probably I might get all of them except maybe the Lucius Malfoy ones because I don't need a second Lucius Malfoy though that hair piece is really nice to get multiples of but let me know which ones were your favorites and I'll see you guys later. Peace out. Bye